Good morning, candy lovers. I'm Craig Merrill, and this is my wife, Sarah. We're from Merrill Mischief in downtown Morganton, North Carolina. And it's Thursday, so it must be candy for breakfast. We are outside today because it's absolutely gorgeous. gorgeous. We're not sure how this is going to work. There might be some traffic noise, but we shall see. So, yeah. All right, so today we are having Mary Jane. Ooh. Now, you've had these, I I've think. Had right? Mary Jane, yeah. I have not had a Mary Jane, believe it or not. But I do know, so this is a, um, if you're not familiar with it, this is a very old time candy. Mm -hmm. I think I looked it up once, 1918, maybe. Okay. And the, one thing I do remember when I looked it up is the guy who made these originally, he, he cooked them in his kitchen. Okay. He named them after his his aunt, Mary Jane, which is weird because there's a little girl's picture on it. But <laughs> yeah. And he cooked it in a kitchen of the house that used to belong to Paul Revere. Wow. So obviously it was She's Massachusetts. Yeah, and it's a miracle <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> so they are peanut butter and molasses. Now they're usually smaller than this, right? Well, uh, yes. This is the original packaging, so they all look like this. These are actually double sized ones, and originally I think they were square. People told me okay. they, they were square. So these are what used to be called penny candy, and we have a, a pirate ship full of penny candy that Craig mm -hmm. built at the store, oh, which yeah. is really cool. If you haven't been there, it's pretty awesome looking. I'm gonna break mine in half. Okay, so it's made with molasses, which a lot of people used as a sweetener because white sugar was... A sweetener, that means it can go in my coffee. That's right. Actually, I was gonna keep mine so I could stir my coffee yeah. with it. Yeah. All right, I'm take a little bite or you'll be chewing forever. Cheers. Mm. Yep. It tastes old fashioned. <laughs> it's really good. Yeah. It's the molasses. You know, yep. a lot of people don't cook with molasses anymore, but it's like gingerbread mm. cookies and mm, and it's just enough peanut butter. It's not overwhelming. It's not like just yep. a peanut butter. And candy. I love peanut butter, but uh, right. this right. is a great candidate for our freeze dried candy. You think it would mm -hmm. explode? Oh yeah. All right. Yep. Cool. We well, we shot. may give that a try. But. Yeah. So if you haven't had a Mary Jane. Give it a try. It's over what? So it's 1918 and it's 2024. Over 100 years old and wow. still kicking. That's still right. good. That's right. <laughs> so if you get a chance, stop by and see us. Downtown Morganton, 105 East Union. Have a great Have a Thursday. great day.